Alrighty, how's it going guys? We are uh, back with some Dying Link 2 here. We're gonna do maybe one more side quest before we go and do the main mission. Um, we will do... What the fuck am I doing? We will do... Uh, this side quest right here, and then I will uh, go ahead and head towards this main mission here. So, um, sorry if you guys want to see the main quest here. I promise you, I will do be doing that uh, maybe next episode here, which I will have uploaded right away. Um, I'm not sure if I want to make these long episodes or if I want to make them short episodes. I haven't been doing a lot of editing to them mostly just because I want to get as much gameplay as I can in it to show you uh, the map, how the world works, how the parkour works and all that stuff. Um, a lot of this stuff is pre-recorded so uh, if you want to see more more like longer episodes let me know I'm not gonna pre-record for too long I just want to get enough enough content out there uh, we might also actually get that inhibitor container after I do this mission hey there rehearsing for the big night where did you come from handsome I heard you uh, go fuck singing. yourself don't lie to Lola sweet cheeks I bet you thought someone was strangling a cat. I did. Uh, not at all. I, I... See this neck? You shouldn't be able to. Usually, it's wrapped in the softest, most rare of mink stoles. Lola was the grand dame of the bazaar. But until reunited with her beloved mink stole, she is unfit to perform. But how will Lola dazzle anyone without her beloved mink stole? Without it? I can't hit the high notes. Then you don't see Mink scampering about everywhere, do you? Oh, where is it? Earlier, a strong gust of wind ripped it from Lola's tender throat and carried it away. I saw it flapping from the scaffolding near the GRE quarantine at the intersection of Market and Horseshoe. Lola is powerless to retrieve it. Well, uh, I could. Would you? Lola could return to the bazaar to entertain, not frighten children like a lurking screamer. Well, we can't have that. No, indeed. Thank you, my knight in shining... whatever it is that you're wearing. I shall await you at the bazaar. Hurry, my fans await. The f fuck is a minx? Uh, let's get that GRE key and container before we go and uh, get her shit. There's also a uh, fucking windmill close by. I think it's down here, which is what I'm trying to get. So, oh wait, it is. It's in this building. I'm pretty sure. I'll, I'll do a takedown on you, fucker. <laughs> Bitch. Give me this. I need these. Alrighty. I got two. That's mint. Okay. Got my inhibitor, so... Let's go ahead. <laughs> And go and get her fucking stupid ass scarf so she can sing. Terribly. <laughs> uh, but yeah, no, again, these are recorded uh, in advance. Mostly just because uh, I do have school and all that stuff, uh, my university. So uh, I don't have a whole lot of time to record and edit, so I'm just trying to get to uh, put as much as out there as I can before I get busy. Today is the weekend, so I'm going to try and record as much as I can before I have to go and uh, be busy again. So, uh, But uh, once the weekend's over, if you guys have any comments on uh, how you want me to play the game, go ahead and comment and let me know if you want longer videos, shorter videos, whatever, more story stuff, more side quest stuff. Uh, I do like doing side quest stuff just because it gives you some stuff you can use towards the main stuff. And I'm pretty sure the way that this game works is that uh, it gives you a few side quest stuff before, like a few, like kind of like what GTA did, 
um, primarily with uh, the fact that you can you can do like the strangers and freaks and all that stuff and like all the side quest stuff in GTA 5 and then before you can actually continue doing the side quest stuff you have to go through with the main story stuff so I'm pretty sure that's how it works with this game so I could probably just complete all the side quests and then work my way towards the mainer stuff but uh, again I will let you guys decide I can do whatever it's not the not the end of the world to me uh, but yeah but yeah let's just focus on getting this scarf right now uh, which is very fucking there Fuck. Almost had it. Okay. It's up more. Oh shit. That's not good. There we go. And there it goes. Come here, you little shit. There's another inhibitor nearby. Got it. Got it. Oh, this looks more like squirrel than a mink. Now I'd better get to the bazaar and give this to Lola. Uh, I believe that inhibitor that it was nearby that I found. I think that's the one that's inside this area. That uh, anything that's like marked in red technically like you can see right there this windmill right here is marked in red so uh, I technically don't have enough stamina if you can see the lightning bolt with 300 I don't have enough stamina to unlock said um, windmill uh, and I've tried before with my previous playthrough that I did uh, with red sometimes you can but you need to have enough stamina because you can't climb all the way up and same with this right here. This is a level four. Technically, I could do this. It's just like if I if I get caught or trapped or whatever, I'm dead. So I'll probably just do that once I level up a little bit more. Um, and then this is another area that I could unlock, which I could probably do right now. Actually, quick sense that I'm right next to it, just to have it. I like having all the safe areas unlocked. I think I can actually go down here. I've never actually went down one of these before, so. There we are. Don't look at me. Don't look at me. Don't look at me. Fuck off. There's an inhibitor container nearby. It might be inside this location that I'm about to go to. Ah, oh, shit, I didn't press B fast enough. Hey! Safes. Okay, these things are new. These are a little bit weird. I kind of got them figured out, so... Okay, so it vibrated at, I think, 2 or 1. 1. So then I go back to zero. So it vibrated at one again. No, zero this time. So if I go to 50, if 50 vibrates, then it will be zero. So this on TikTok. Yeah, so it's zero. And then if I go back to zero. Oh, one vibrated. There we go. Did I get a? Uh, I did get an inhibitor. Fuck yeah. Hey, I can upgrade again. And I think I will do that right now, actually. So I do like to try and balance it. So I am level one in stamina and level one in health. I think I want more stamina, just because stamina seems like it gets you a little bit farther. 
necessarily speaking, especially with the safe zones, with the uh, windmills and all that stuff. So, but I do try and balance. So since I level up my stamina, I will switch over to my health next time I get enough inhibitors to do that. Uh, and it, as you can see, my immunity when uh, is going up from I think it was at like four minutes before or something like that. I don't think it goes up a lot, but uh, I can stay in the darkness during nighttime for about five minutes and 27 seconds and this goes up when you add inhibitors to your character but yeah I now have a upgraded my stamina I'm going to unlock this safe zone Night runners out hideout. Fuck yeah. Okay. So there's a safe zone. We're gonna head out of this place here now, and we're gonna head to the uh, <coughs> the the side quest mission that I was gonna do, or that I did. Mink soul stole soul stole. Go fuck yourself. I'm not fighting you. I might be able to actually get two missions done in uh, this episode, so two side quests done. But you know, I'm a big, uh, big on the parkour here. I'm not big on the combat. Combat's pretty simple. Um, uh, I'm pretty sure, like I said in the first episode of this series, they they took a they took away all the guns, so there's no technically no guns. There's still bows, so there's still ranged combat and all that, but. Uh, um, but you know, I don't, uh, I'm pretty sure my last playthrough I used the bow maybe until the ammo was up and I tried to craft more arrows and didn't do anything, so, yeah. Oh, here you go. My precious mink! Oh, you are truly sent from above. Lola is complete once more. You deserve a reward. Do you wish Lola to reward you with a song? Yeah. Sure, why not? I sleep and I dream of your love. You were sent from above like a soft turtle dove. Gross. Are you not hypnotized? Are you not enthralled by Lola's voice? I am. I am. That was otherworldly. Such a compliment. You were such a dear boy. And a terrible liar. But Lola appreciates your kindness. You deserve a more proper reward than a song anyway. Take this with Lola's deepest gratitude. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, you're shit at singing. Okay. Lola will make a comeback. You'll see. And this fucking guy. And uh, how many quests are there on the map? So there's one here, and there's one over here. Uh, I think I'll do this guy here. Just cause. And uh, I think this will be the last quest for the uh, for the whole episode. So if I can get two done in one episode, that'd be great. Don't recognize me? Or are you allergic to making money? Listen, Pilgrim. We can make a killing, you and me. 
You just need to get me some beets, radishes, parsnips. There he is. Grab him, Ed. He's a murderer. What? Julian, Luke's been poisoned. From the water you sold him, Devin says. What? But... I don't sell water. Liar. Luke told me he got it from you. Whatever's in it has him ranting and raving now. You're sure he didn't blame me after he started ranting? Oh, well, wait a minute. Do you have proof? Of course. The water came in a bottle. Luke got that water in one of your bottles. When I tell Carl about this, you'll hang! Bevan, wait! I swear, I don't even sell water, damn it! If you're lying, Julian, you're fucking toast! Word on the rooftops is that. Wait, so then, if you're not selling water, how'd someone get a hold of one of your bottles? Knowing that shithead Luke, he probably stole it. That would be like him. Even if he did, my water's pure as melted snowflakes. So, uh, maybe it's revenge. For what? Everyone loves me. Never had an enemy in my life. Wait a second. Wait. Shit. Except maybe Marco. That bastard. Come to think of it, he's got an axe to grind for me. It was a long time ago. Never mind. Listen. He lives above an old shop on the west end of Villador, on Houndfield Lane. I traded him a few kilos of my finest flour for the water. Prove he poisoned it, and half my flour is yours. Can you do that for me? I guess I could check it out. And there's one more thing. I'm a little embarrassed. Hans might also have a bottle of this water. I thought you weren't selling it. I'm not, except, well, to Hans and... Can you go warn him? He's also on Hanfield, a few buildings down. Something's fishy about this, Julian. Look, you better be telling the truth, otherwise it'll be hard to help you. Okay. Let's go and fucking... Help this man. Let's go to one. Oh, the parkour is so good in this. Thank you. You can go fuck yourself, I'm not... Go ahead, blow your horn. I'm not fighting you. It's not worth my time right now. As much as I'd like to fight you, like, I, I would fuck you up. But, nah, I'm not doing that right now. I believe that's for the hospital. Yeah, it's for the hospital. Which I'm not doing just yet. I will probably make a separate video for that uh, when I'm ready. Uh, I don't think I'm equipped enough to do any of that, and I'm also not doing the fucking side quest. You can go fuck yourself. It looks like it's also gonna be nighttime soon, so I don't really want to be fucking around during nighttime. I just want to get this done. Thank you. So yeah, so you can see the timer in the top, uh, top middle of my screen there. I have five minutes until I turn. It's just because it's dark out. So the way that they can, this game works with the, its infected shit is uh, since I'm infected, it's not antizen that I'm worried about. It is the 
uh, fuck, what is it? It's the it's a different type of infection. So uh, the longer I'm in the dark, the the faster I will turn. How in the fuck do I get down there again? I forget. There's no way that I go down to the basement, is it? I think I do, actually. I think I go... Oh, shit. Yeah, no, it's not definitely not that. I think I just climb up or something like that. Okay, I will. I'll jump over here. Waste my energy. It's almost nighttime, too. Don't think that. I don't think I go through the basement. Unless there is a way to get through it from here. There might be like a little tunnel or something like that that I can fall down. Or I could just be completely fucking stupid. Not see a way down. There we go. Okay. What's up, you piece of shit? Great. Another water thief. Just what I need. Between thieves and infected, I'll be out of business soon. I'm here because a guy named Julian claims you sold him poisoned water. I didn't poison anything. All right? Uh, Julian claims otherwise. Sure. Listen to the guy who sold me flour mixed with plaster. If you're not the thief, how are you with infected? I need to get rid of those things that are down there. If not, I'm done here. Poison water or not. Okay, I'll get rid of the infected, and you tell me what happened. Deal? Sure. Deal. <sighs> I guess so. Oh, there's runners. Oh, the stamina is low. I'm gonna crouch. Hello. Thank you. Yeah, you can't come through here, you fuckers. I'm gonna heal. You can fuck off with that. And I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna fuck you up. You get the fuck off of me, bitch. Your eyeball is fucking popping out. Bam! Perfect. And I'm gonna block this door. Bitch. Make way, kid. Go fuck yourself. All right, okay, you're safe. Now, what's the story with the water? Go wait. <laughs> Loser got a center with four pulls. I can do it in three. Fucked up. Now we're safe. Gotta be a fucking criminal. Or pretty damn fucked up to drag your ass hundreds of miles through a world full of virals. Fucked up in a good way, of course. So, what about the water? There ain't nothing wrong with my water. The man at the bazaar was poisoned. And you'll be blamed if he dies. <sighs> damn it. Okay. It was an accident, okay? Yeah, an accident. It's because of these goddamn thieves. Thieves? They're always stealing my water. I can't take it anymore. So I decided to set the trap. So you deliberately poison the water to kill the bandits? Uh, not quite. At least uh, I didn't mean to. A, a while ago, I killed this viral that came crawling in here. And the fucker fell straight into a tub. The whole tub fucking ruined. But then I got this idea. Why don't I teach these bastards a lesson? So I filled some bottles with the zombie water, sent them out where they'd be easy to see, 
They were never supposed to make it into the bazaar. Guess I was sauced up and accidentally sold a few bottles to Julian. Look, I'll give you all the flour I got. I'll even throw something extra. Just don't tell anybody. I'd be ruined. They'll blame Julian and he'll hang. Don't you worry about Julian. A weasel like him will find a way to weasel out of it. And if not, then that's one weasel less in the world. So, we got a deal? Uh, you know what? My first playthrough, I killed this fucking guy because I said I was going to tell the truth. This one, I'm fine okay. with it. It's a deal. Here's your flower. And here's something extra. Man! I believe I still actually have... Huh. Maybe I don't. Okay. Does that just completely cut that quest off then? The second part of it? That's upsetting. Oh, fuck yeah, dude. You got some squats, dude. Jesus. Okay. Uh, you know, my first playthrough, I fucking destroyed that guy. Like, I fucked him up pretty good. <laughs> Um, but, uh, this one I think I won't, just cause, like, yeah, defending against bandits, I kinda, I get it. And my first playthrough, I also didn't know that I was fucking him up. So, not too worried about it. But yeah. Um, I'm gonna leave it here. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Um, I will see you in the next episode. I don't think there's much quests left that, like side quests that I would be doing. I think there's one. So next episode I will probably get this singular quest done and then head straight to the main quest there. Um, and on my way I'll probably unlock a few of these little, uh, question marks here just so that way I can get them out of the way. Uh, they will, there will be a bunch of quests down here that I will unlock these ones, so we should be good there. Uh, but anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys in the next video here, and bye.